Hello everyone and welcome back to Prodigal Overland. My name's Brad. If you're new here, you've come in to kind of like a quarterly update. So I'm not sure this is the first video that you want to watch. Um, so maybe pause this video, go check out Poison Spider Trail or Moab and, and see what that's all about. Um, anyway, but if you've been following us for a while, welcome back. Thanks for being here. Today's video, we're gonna go over two main things, okay? There's gonna be some updates in our YouTube channel and also some updates with the events that we've been doing. So I hope you stick around and we're gonna get started right after this. All right, guys, so what's going on today? All right, we're gonna start with talking about the YouTube stuff and then talking about the events. Um, so yeah, let's get going. So changes or additions actually to our, our YouTube channel. So we've done a lot of Jeep stuff, a lot of adventures, and that's gonna keep going. So if you only like watching the trail rides, they're gonna keep coming out, we're gonna keep doing trails, we're gonna keep showcasing the, the Jeep Grand Cherokee, and those are primarily going to happen and come out on Fridays if we have our game together. So those weekend videos are what that's gonna be. Now, we're gonna to start to try to bring other content in, and again, I'm anticipating that this will be kind of a ramp up, so I can't say we're gonna every week have two videos, but we're gonna aim for that. Um, and the kind of the midweek video we're aiming for on a Tuesday-ish, <laughs> again, if I have my act together. And, and those videos are gonna be more maybe educational, um, off-roading tips, install videos. We have some stuff coming in from Chief Products that I'm gonna be putting on the Jeep, should be here within the week, hopefully. Um, and so those videos will probably be more like midweek videos, um, just different things we're learning along the way, but but honestly, we're gonna start throwing in some other stuff too, kind of about this full-time travel deal that we do, and some of these other things, maybe that aren't specific to trail rides, are gonna start kind of getting introduced on Tuesday. So, again, if you only wanna see the trail rides and all that, nothing's gonna change, they're gonna be there Fridays, but we're gonna start to introduce other content on Tuesdays to kind of give you guys educational stuff but also more of a, a picture of kind of what we're about or just our life or life on the road that kind of stuff um our daughter nora is becoming more interested in making videos and stuff like that and so we might have her try to you know work in some videos there as well but that's going to start kind of ramping up so look for that along with that if there's topics that you want to see us produce that aren't just the trail rides like what's it like to live in an rv or full-time travel or how did you get into this stuff um things that we've picked up along the way things we've learned about off-roading whatever feel free to comment below put that below and we'll take it under consideration so the second part of this video and what i want to talk about are our events our meetups so if you're not aware we do meetups across the country and honestly that's been a very slow kind of ramp up process for us so we wanted to make sure that we had the skills and that we had the knowledge and the personalities to be able to take newbies off-road with us and, and get them through safely and ha help them to have a great time in their, their Jeep or their vehicle and, and not like trash their vehicle while they're out with us. And so I'm happy to say that we've been very successful in doing that. We've gotten a lot of good feedback from people and these events have gone really, really well for us. When we first had the idea of starting these events, we wanted to find a way that would distinguish them from just your regular old meetup with a Jeep club or um, going out on the trail with a buddy, okay? What we have found and what I found is that making a transition from, from kind of always being on pavement to trying to get into some off-roading is that sometimes it's kind of a high bar. There's a lot of folks that know a ton about off-roading and when you step onto these forums and online, it's easy to feel overwhelmed, like, oh my gosh, I don't even know what's going on. And so 
we wanted to be able to kind of bridge that gap for people, for people that, especially with this whole COVID stuff and feeling trapped inside and locked inside or not need, you know, unable to be around people or these large gatherings, we want to create a space where you can get outside away from these main cities, these hubs out, out. I mean, we are, we are out in the desert right now. I'm filming this in the desert by Moab. And so we want to get people outside and, and show them parts of the country that they might have never ever seen before. And also, if you're brand new to off-roading, we want to help make that transition so that you can feel comfortable going out off-road and, and feel fairly certain that you're not going to completely wreck your vehicle. Okay, so that's, that's kind of our goal is we want to be that bridge that kind of helps bridge that gap to get people started and, and give them a taste of um, that experience. And, and being as we're a family of five, we want to make that super kid friendly um, and also very friendly um, for spouses that maybe aren't so interested. Um, and obviously you don't have to have kids or be married to come along with us. Um, truly, 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 we just love meeting people um, and getting to know people. One of the benefits of traveling for us and for our kids is that we get to see so many different places and meet so many different people. And I think what I've learned is it's very easy to get kind of tunnel vision and, and, and focused in on how you do life. And, and it's easy to think that the only way to do life is how you're doing life. And it's been a lot of fun for us to meet um, people that travel full time like us to meet people that are just coming out for the weekend. And we all have these different stories and, and different life experiences that kind of shape who we are. And Laura and I have such a good time getting to hear people's stories, um, to sit around campfires, to share life, but also to share these little adventures. And, and honestly, by the time you're done um, going out on a trail ride, and by the time you're done spending a weekend with us out on the trail, I, I can almost guarantee that you're gonna feel like you picked up some good friends, that you've had some great experiences, and that it was just, just honestly, super worthwhile. And, and that's really our hope for these events. Lauren and I have always really enjoyed hosting people, and so this for both of us is just a pleasure. Um, we love the off-roading, but if you watch our channel, and you follow us along, you know we love meeting people, okay? And I, we love getting together with all kinds of people and, and, and have had just a blast doing that. And so this fits very well in kind of our wheelhouse of hosting people and, and now getting people out off-road. Um, so these events are gonna start scaling up here in just a little bit. And if you go to our website after watching this video, and I'll put links below for our events, but we're gonna have a couple in Southern California coming up in December and January that you can go check that out. We've had lots of people from Southern California kind of reach out and say, hey, when are you coming to California? And I can say, hey, we're coming to California. Um, another thing to note about these events is that we intentionally keep the size small, okay? So this isn't like a, like a Jeep Safari or a Jeep Jamboree or a big event where you're gonna show up and there's gonna be 20 other Jeeps there or 100 other Jeeps there. We really try to keep it small so that there can be a tight community that kind of forms. And, and what we have found through these trips is that we start out the day with people that we've not met and we, we don't know and by the end of the trail ride and, and you know, we often will do a dinner and, and for these new trips, they're gonna be a Friday or a Sunday deal. So you're gonna come in on a Friday, maybe after work, meet up with us, we're gonna have a meal for you, we're gonna have a campfire, we're gonna sit around, we're gonna tell you what trail we're gonna be doing. Saturday, we're gonna do a trail ride, we're gonna feed you breakfast, we're gonna feed you lunch, we're gonna feed you dinner. We're gonna make sure you have water and drinks and all that and then if we still got some in the tank Sunday morning, we can go out and do some more. So we are have the ability to be pretty open and flexible and that this is this is what we do. So this is this is what we do. We don't have a side gig, this is the gig. And so um, along with that, we wanna really be able to tailor these experiences and, and customize them to the people that are coming. You're gonna see Sometimes that we on these trips we might just list an, an area like the Moab one says Moab It doesn't say Fins and Things Trail or Hell's Revenge or or uh, Schaefer's Trail or something like that and the reason for that is What we do is as you book a trip with us 
we're gonna reach out before the event. I'm gonna call you and just get a feel for where you're at. What's your off-roading experience? Are you brand new? Has your, has your four-wheel drive vehicle never been out off-road? Or do you have a little protection and you've been out several times and you just wanna meet up and, and, and do maybe a trail that, that is a little more difficult than what you're used to? And so of the people that kinda of come out, we, we gather in that information and then based on that decide where we're gonna go. So our main goal for these trips for the people that are coming is that you come and that you feel like things were just prepped for me. Like I just showed up, I didn't have to stress over it and these guys walked us through. We found actually that there's quite a bit of education that happens on the trails. We've seen a, a few recurrent things of things that just need to go over from tire pressures to um, if you have a Jeep Grand Cherokee, what mode should I be in? Should I be in four high, four low? Uh, what line should I pick? Things like this. And so, so when you come out with us, that kind of on-trail education is happening on the trail. You know, as we run into things, we're, we're talking about them and, and walking you through them and hopefully preventing you from making mistakes that will cost you um, <laughs> a lot more than the price of the trip. <laughs> That she that she come out with, and, and we found that I think I think as a beginner coming out off road, it's you, you kind of feel your way through things. If you watch a lot of our earlier videos, um, I'm I'm just trashing things on the Jeep on a somewhat regular basis, and so um, you know as you go, you learn. Oh, I shouldn't have done that, or I should have taken a different line, and that sort of thing. And and because we've been through a lot of that, we're able to help people that are brand new kind of navigate things and and hopefully save a lot of frustration. So along with that, um, as we've developed these trips, what you're gonna see is, yeah, now there's a price tag attached to them, okay? And, and, and we put a lot of thought into this. We looked at what other people are charging for similar services, and, and we wanna make it fair and, and, and valuable, but honestly, like, also enough that we can support ourselves. You know, our goal for this year is sustainability. If we were to go on the income we're pulling in right now, um, we're not gonna be able to sustain ourselves. So we need to get to a point that we're able to sustain in what we're doing because we're, we honestly, we love it. It's, it's great. Um, and we wanna partner with people to, to kind of help us meet our goals, but also to help you guys get out off road and, and give you these experiences. Another thing to kind of note is that a while ago we did start a Patreon page. What is Patreon? Patreon is a way that for just a few bucks a month, five, ten dollars a month, that you can kind of help support what we do. Obviously there's there's costs involved and it's, it's a way to give just a little bit back. Um, if signing up there's different levels but you get to see the videos before they come out there's certain levels that give you a discount on kind of our merchandise and that sort of thing so if you like our stuff and you you would like to support us we'd love to have you support us so head over to patreon again i'll put that link below um, but that's what patreon is but lastly guys i just really want to say thank you so much for the support and encouragement it goes a long way for us um, if you've ever started something brand new and for us starting this business up and getting it going, um, not having a business background and kind of fumbling our way through the YouTube and the editing and the websites and the events, um, it, it goes a long way to get feedback from you guys and the encouragement. So truly, truly, we thank you for that. Um, anyway, I hope you guys like this video. Um, I hope you watch this video, share this video, look for more content coming out. Like I said, we're gonna try to come up to two videos a week. If there's something you wanna see, put it in the description below. If there's some place you'd like, not the description, the comments below. If you wanna meet up with us somewhere and you're dying for us to come to a location near you, put that in the comments below. And guys, we'll see you again real soon.